Game 2, Golden Horseshoe Semi-Finals, Gale Center, Niagara Falls, Ontario. Caledonia Corvairs taking on the Niagara Falls Canucks. Scoring opened up at 11.47 of the first when Corey Powley potted his first of the game from a Matt Hoare rebound and beat Adam Denico, 1-0 Caledonia. Additional assist to Mitchell Fitzmorris. Matt Hoare made it 2-0 on the power play just over four minutes later when he deflected a shot from the point from Corey Powley and Blake Glishcomb. It took only 25 seconds into the second for Niagara to get on the board. Matthew Marsden picked up the rebound out front of Mark Sinclair and made no mistake reducing Caledonia's lead to one. Assisted by Frank Pucci and Zach Lansfeld. Less than two minutes later, Niagara would tie the game on a missed clearing attempt by the Corvairs. Zach Lansfield scored a power play marker at 228, assisted by Matthew Marsden and Frank Pucci. The third period was all Corvairs and all Corey Pauli. He scored his first goal of the period on the power play a little over one minute in on a pass from Daniel Volpe, 3-2 Corvairs. He extended the Corvair's lead to two and completed his hat trick just past the midway point of the third from a great pass out front from Mitchell Fitzmorris and Matt Hoare, 4-2 Corvairs. Corey completed the scoring for the Corvairs with under five left in the third when he took a pass from Mitchell Fitzmorris in alone and beat Denico catcher side, 5-2 Corvairs. That's the way it would end. The Corvairs face the Canucks for Game 3 of the semifinals Saturday at the HCCC in Caledonia. They're up two games to none in the series.